Back to Water Fan TV, the joy and the pain. Uh, we're here to look at the match preview of Walsall at home to Bolton. First round of the FA Cup. Uh, we're also going to have a look at what's going on in League One. Right then, first of all, Bolton. Uh, we were hoping to get Stunt Peg on. Uh, Neve Petricelli. Petricelli or something like that. Um, but no response from her, so that was a, a disappointment. I'm not sure whether we, she's still covering Bolton. Um, she used to be the Bolton uh, lass, but seems to be wandering off doing all kinds of other stuff. She's certainly doing very, very well on YouTube, so uh, that can't be knocked. Um, but yeah, Bolton. Um, good win on Tuesday night. 4-1 uh, away win. At Stevenage. Um, puts them up to sixth. Uh, six wins in eight. So they're coming into this game on good form. Ian Everett, the manager. He's um, gone through the mill. But he's uh, he's doing well with them, isn't he? He's doing well with them. Um, the only defeat they've had in the last eight was Birmingham. Which, of course, uh, Warsaw managed to beat in the uh, Bristol Street Motors uh, Trophy, albeit with a penalty um, penalty shootout victory. But we've done well against League One teams so far, haven't we? Beat Exeter, beat Huddersfield, um, say a draw and then a penalty shootout victory over Birmingham. So Bolton, is this another one we could scalp? Um, I'm not so sure. They're on good form, aren't they, Bolton? Dion Charles got his uh, got the fourth. That's his sixth goal of the season. So um, yeah, it's going to be a tough one. It's going to be a tough one. Um, and what are Walsall going to do? What are what, how are Walsall going to view this one? Um, for the other cup matches, we've made changes, but this is. The, uh, the FA Cup, all the glory of the FA Cup. So um, can Warsaw approach it um, full, fully gung-ho? Or are we going to be make, ch making changes? Um, before we look at potential changes, let's just have a look at the proposed starting lineup for Bolton. I think we're likely to have Southwood in goal in a 3-4-2-1 formation. Toll, Santos and Johnson at the back, back three. Santos scored a header against Stevenage, his first goal in 18 months. Um, four in midfield. Now, this is where we're going to be uh, having some challenges. Dacris, Cogley, Sheehan, Matetti and Schoen. Uh, Schoen on the uh, left wing, number 23, he is definitely one to watch out for. Collins and McAtee, um, sort of just off Adebayo. 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 Something like that. Um, yeah, McAtee, of course, is uh, another quality player. Um, but Huddersfield. Huddersfield put a good team out against us, and they're up there. So, um... We shall have to see, shall we? Right then, top of the league in League One, Birmingham. Uh, Wickham, that's a bit of a surprise seeing them up there. Um, Wrexham, obviously from League Two last season in third. Mansfield in fourth. So, um, the old uh, League One boys doing quite well, aren't they? Huddersfield, that we uh, knocked out the, uh, the League Cup. They're uh, in seventh. Uh, Stockport doing well in 10th, thanks to Louis Barry. Nine goals so far this season. So that's um, that's pretty good. And uh, Down the bottom, uh, Burton, four points. They are heading back to League Two, almost certainly with their poor start to the season. Just four draws out of the first 12 games. Um, Shrewsbury probably joining them. Uh, Crawley um, had a very good win. At um, Lincoln, one three nil. But other than that, they've uh, they've been struggling a bit. So they're probably heading down. Cambridge look to be heading down, but three wins on the bounce. Um, a new lease of life I've had. 
which brings Leighton Orient into the frame. They're just a point above them at the minute. Um, and then we've got the likes of Wigan and Northampton and Bristol Rovers. Um, just above them, Bristol Rovers, Isaac Hutchinson. Wouldn't it be weird if he returned to League Two as Warsaw got promoted? That would uh, that would be an interesting one. But right then, let's get into the detail for Warsaw. Um, I think we Matt Sadler will make some changes, but perhaps uh, not too many. Um, Sam Hornby is the cup goalkeeper, I think. So I think Sam Hornby will come in at the back. We could potentially bring Oshie. Donovan Daniels and Evan Weir into the back three and completely change the back three and give him minutes. But I don't think he's going to be that crazy to change it around that much. But I wouldn't be surprised to see 45 minutes for a couple of those. Um, maybe Oshie on for the second half um, for David Kagbu, perhaps. Evan Weir, I think uh, he's not been making the bench recently. So uh, he's definitely going to be on the bench. I think um, whether he rests Taylor Allen or, or Liam Gordon and uh, gives Evan Weir some more minutes, I think that's possible as well. Um, in the middle, Sturk, um, maybe 45 and Comley 45. Um, Jamie Jellis doing very well at the moment. But Ram, again, Ram's not been in the squad. Um, he needs minutes. Is he going to get cut minutes? That's possible. Um, Lakin Earring could be a start for like uh, start for Earring. Perhaps rest Lakin a little bit. Of course, we've got George Hall as well. Um, I think he's probably not ready for a full start. Um, and then up front, Matt and Low. Matt, such a big player for us, um, such a dominant force this season so far. Is it a game to rest him? Uh, maybe play low up front with a Doma, perhaps? Um, or will a Doma come on for uh, Connor Barrett? Several options there. Cleary and DJ. I don't think DJ is ready for a start, but a good 30 minutes for him would be good. So maybe um, a good 45 minutes plus for Cleary. Lots of questions over this one. If we get some extra insights, I'll be back with those. But um, for the minute, I think um, predictions. What is your thoughts? Are we going to treat this one with the respect it deserves? And how will Bolton um, set up? You'd think, with a the run they're on, similar to Warsaw, they want to keep it going and play as full a strength team as possible. Um, without a game on Tuesday, um, Warsaw had a rest, of course. And um, So, there's lots of questions. Lots of questions around that. My prediction, I'm going crazy. I'm going 2-1 Warsaw. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Join the pain. Thanks for watching.